Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In less than a week, the highly anticipated first Starship flight will take place. It may seem surreal, but it is indeed happening. The Starship S24 has been de-stacked from Booster 7 to install the flight termination system, which is mandatory for all rockets. The FTS for Starship will consist of four explosive charges, two on the booster and two on the ship, and will be activated if either the booster or the ship goes off course. This will ensure the rocket is blown up without causing harm to human life. In case the FTS is activated, it will be done within an exclusion zone to guarantee safety. Once the FTS is armed, S-24 will be restacked and ready for launch. The FAA launch license could be issued anytime now or on the launch day. All road closures scheduled have been canceled, no more testing. The next major activity we will see on the launch pad is the first ever Starship launch attempt. The Transporter 7 mission from SLC-4E at Vandenberg Space Force Base in California has been delayed due to pre-launch checkouts and weather concerns. The launch, which was originally scheduled for April 10th, has been rescheduled for tomorrow at 11.48 p.m. Pacific Time. Meanwhile, at Launch Complex 39A in Florida, SpaceX is also gearing up for another Falcon Heavy mission on April 18th, which will be the sixth Falcon Heavy flight to date. The rocket will carry the Viasat-3 America's broadband communications satellite, as well as a small communications satellite called Arcturus. Unlike previous missions, all three boosters will be expended after the flight as there are no grid fins or landing legs on any of them. This will be the second of at least five Falcon Heavy missions planned for this year. April is shaping up to be an exciting month for SpaceX with both the Starship and Falcon Heavy missions scheduled for launch. The European Space Agency will attempt to launch its interplanetary spacecraft, the JUICE mission tomorrow at 2.25 p.m. Central European Summer Time or 8.15 a.m. Eastern Time. JUICE mission will study Jupiter and its icy moons. JUICE stands for Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, and the mission is set to launch atop an Ariane 5 rocket from Iela 3 in French Guiana. The spacecraft will reach Jupiter in July 2031 after four gravity assists and eight years of travel. That is it for now. Thank you for watching it till the end. See you in the next video.